Okay, I'm gonna get up right up here in your teeth so you can see what's going on here. Right here is where your spot weld is, right at the end of that. So what you wanna do is get the center of each one of these holes with the little drill bit. <clears throat> this is just a like a spring-loaded pointer and it's just it's just easier to drill the hole first. So we'll drill this one. Get this one here. And this uh, spot weld driller that I bought is pretty cheap off of Amazon, and I've had very good results with it. It has like, a sorry, it has like a dozen bits, and I don't think I've any used two of them. So All right, that'll be enough for our demonstration here. I pull the drill bit back out. <clears throat> Jam the spot weld driller in here, and you'll be able to see how this works. Like I said it's just a bunch of little teeth that go around there. I'm sure this is loud because the drill is literally a half an inch. In I think we're good. It's real easy to go through the second layer, which I'm trying not to. There we go. Once you get it started, it's a lot easier to tell. There you can see, we're definitely through. That's exactly how you want to do it. Just get through the first layer. So I'll let this guy in here, and then uh, we'll start on the second one. And now that there's a screwdriver in there, it should make a coffin noise like that. <laughs> or some sort of movement, that way you know when you're through. Same way. And then you'll wedge it up inside, in between the one you just did and the one you're going to do. Okay, move you over here a little bit. Get in your teeth. Same thing. Little nose pop. There, pop loose. Up to this one. Having a little issue. There we go. A little bit more on the bottom of that one. That's it. She's free. So that's it as far as drilling out spot welds. It's pretty simple. Like I said, just get yourself one of these uh, spot weld removal tools. And it's even double sided. So when this side gets dull, you can flip it around and put the other side on. And there's at least a dozen of them. So um, I think they're, they work great for, for this. And I just use a a small drill bit to make a pilot hole to center up this spring loaded like center punch thing so don't be afraid it's as easy to do and then of course you'll uh once you get the panel off you'll grind all that stuff behind there flat drill holes in your new panel and then re-weld them and you're good to go